Gosh, every time a show talks to God, I don't want to hear it at all. Not even a little. I don't want to believe I'll fall. And I'm hurting to see. And I've always been gone in my own head. Boo, you suck! Aww. Hey, what is up, guys? Black John Buzz coming back with a once a month video. And today I heard there's a Dota Plus update after the International Battle Pass ended. They gave us like 10 levels for hitting, what was it, 40, 40 mil? Can I help you? What was that? Yo, I'm in the middle of recording. What do you want? With another legendary video. She, she, oh, the production team, man. No respect for your boy. But I never got the Phoenix. Pretty tilted. Pretty triggered. Didn't even get the levels. I did. I used them. But wait, where was the where's the prize pool at? Oh, here it is. 40 mil. Are you kidding me? What the shit? Bro, we fought. You do it. And that's just 25%. So what is it? 40 mil times 4? Bro, are you telling me Valve really? Are you serious right now? Over 100 million? 40, 40, that's 8 160 million Valve. Are you serious? 25% of all battle pass sales go directly to the inter international 10 prize pool. 75% Valve's pocket. What? 120 million in Valve's pocket. And we didn't even get to see Dota get played. That's ridiculous. And you know what they gave us? 10 levels. You know what I got from my 10 levels? I was at uh, 825 or something. I got... 10 consumable portals, oh my god. I got Immortal Treasure 2, oh my god. I got Luna Dance, oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine getting your 10 levels, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 of your levels being nothing, and then the other two being a consumable, and then shit. Ah, man, that's hilarious. Anyway, um, yeah, that that was a joke. They gave me 10 levels, yo. They said, here, <laughs> here, hold this. <laughs> Hold this L. Ah, uh, man. Okay, so anyway, there's the Dota Plus update. Uh, what the shit are you doing here? Oh, no. I, oh, what? They plan on making me read shit? Nah. Uh, no. Nope. Mm -hmm. Nope. Not happening. Nope. Anyway, so. I'm just going to go experience it myself. Um. Earthshaker is only my highest played hero because, you know, obviously trying to get the second of uh, unlocked ability, but I don't know. Welcome quests. I didn't even finish all these because I never played a battle cup and I don't know what the F this is. Seasonal, uh, those reset. What else? Oh, there's the shard. There's a, sh there's a side shop. There's a shop for it specifically now for Dota Plus. Cute. That's so cute. And there's a treasure. But the treasure costs 10,000 shards. Yeah, the treasure costs 10,000 shards to get one hero. Which, these aren't even amazing sets. Yeah, this is every Nyx set ever. Wait, is he holding two knives? Yeah, oh, that's sick. What the hell? He's holding the knives. It's not even part of his... Yeah, he's holding them. That's kind of cool, I guess. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, oh, see a little cheek. I mean, uh, bro, di didn't we already get this Weaver set? Isn't this already a thing? Don't I already have that? Dude, don't I already have that Weaver set? Get the F out of here, dude. I thought I had that Weaver set. Or did I just see it in the the workshop or something dude like we've seen this weaver set before haven't we was this in the collector's cash vote or something yeah this was in the collector's cash vote i'm pretty sure we've seen that weaver set before it's being recycled from somewhere anyway what the hell is this shit bro that's his teeth oh this is strange bro this makes me feel like some kind of way and they didn't even give him cogs what this shit this doesn't come with any cogs
This doesn't come with cogs? Why? Why didn't they do that? It's such a lazy set. Blue Hyperstone Void? Bro, I'm telling you, unless you give Void an immortal set like you guys gave Invoker, he's going to be in the running next year for the for the Arcana vote. What a waste. What a waste. Doom Wings are cute. Everybody knows that. But the rest of the set, once again, this is from the side shop, dude. No, not this is from um, the market. Uh, well, you, know, you guys know what I'm talking about. The workshop. Yeah, this is a set from the workshop. I've seen this before. The hood. Yeah, I've seen that before. This looks like every... Ten cents fence set I've ever seen. Like all the fence sets that are worth like ten cents, this is it right here. Ah oh, man. Ah, oh, this isn't even worth one shard. What the shit is this? Look at the way it's glued onto his chest, bro. This is lazy. There's not even a back piece. This is lazy. All right, what the f is this? Bro, this is. Oh god. Okay, I like the fist because it has like a little face on it. But the rest of this set is so base. Oh. Does the shark open its mouth? No? Alright, basic ass set. Uh, I guess this is the only thing people really want, the very rare. Everything else is just kind of there, just cause. Let me open one because that's how life is, right? We gotta we gotta take chances, guys. We gotta take chances. Let's see what we get. Come to daddy! You know I can't Yeah, come on! Come on, openings? Come on, that's my thing. Come on. Give me the Phoenix. <laughs> Isn't it like one in 20 million? Ah, uh, shit. Ooh, Ventral Sphere. God damn it. Oh, you can recycle? Why? Why would you ever do that? I guess to get the bird? Who knows, man? Who knows? But yeah, alright. So this is, this is, if you guys have like a shit ton of shards, unlike me, I spend all my shards. Well, if you watch my streams, you know I spend my shards in very stupid ways. Um, did they add any premium sets? Okay, so this is false advertisement. I thought Void and Sven were gonna get s premium sets. I thought that's what this was. But here, here I am, dumbfounded and betrayed. I've been bamboozled, hoodwinked. That's not even a word, and I agree with you. Oh God! All right, hero relics. Yeah, I spend most of my shards just rolling relics. Kunk, I've been I've been very fruitful. Been very fruitful. Um pfft, chat wheels, nothing new. What is this? Yeah, let me get Man bro, they should have made the treasure either purchasable or you could get it for shards, you know? So it it, it uh rewards both players. Also you you can earn shards from just playing, I hear. Uh, win three games, get a thousand. Yeah, I already do that. But um, yeah, they should have made the treasure purchasable, and they should have made it so you could purchase it with shards. Give it two two ways of getting income. Dota two really needs to do that. They should. They, hey Valve, here's a free tip, okay? Make some treasures like the old treasures or something like that. Make those earnable through shards. Like make those purchasable through shards, so you can use shards to buy them, and you can earn shards by playing the game. Whereas people like me who don't play the game as much, we can just come in here and just buy it if we want. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, Valve, you gotta you gotta please everybody, man. Like you're over here pleasing half the group. That's crazy for me. No, I don't understand that shit. But apparently there's some sort of um Got it, got it, got it. I don't even know what the hell this is. Oh yeah, organizes them by roles and then you can like do this and be like, hey, like for me, I would come here and I would say, "Look, how do how do how, how do people play characters in Herald? You know, you know, because I'm Herald. Are pretty much the same thing. So how would people do that? And then um, this is pretty much how it goes. I'm I'm just kidding. Come on, I'm divine, guys. I'm divine. It's me, the divine Smurf. I'm just playing. I'm not really Archon. It's my burner account, yo. I'm really divine, but um, shit. The higher you go up, it's just more heroes on the left, you know. And the more you go down, the more everything is a support or a hard support, and that's the problem with the community, man. That's really the problem with the community. Whenever you're playing these kind of uh, positions right here, people always think that these characters are just hard supports and supports, you know, like they can't be played in position two or three. But you know, they'd be wrong. 
They'd be very wrong. Because look at this shit. Diversity. Whereas an Archon... You know? No diversity. It's crazy. It's a crazy world we live in. It's a crazy world we live in. So, I don't really know what else they added to this shit. What else is new? I'm not the guy that, you know... I'm pretty sure there's, there's other things, but... Ever since I've gotten Dota Plus years ago, I think it was two years ago. I think Dota Plus launched like 2018, and like it's overdue for uh, a review by me. But personally, Dota Plus really isn't worth purchasing, guys. Like, unless you are the laziest human being on earth, Dota Plus really isn't worth purchasing. If you're trying to just be good at the game and make your own decisions and, you know, become a better rounded player, then you don't really need Dota Plus. I use Dota Plus because I'm a lazy person. I don't like reviewing the other team and thinking who should I counter pick, who should I who should I try to counter, who should I beat, who should I, you know, who should I cancel a pick on, who should I ban. No, I don't really think like that. I'm just super lazy. Every game I go into, I, I first ban Sniper or Ursa because, you know, teams lose to those heroes for some god knows what reason. And then I just go in, I let Dota Plus pick a hero for me. That's pretty much it. I see a hero that I like. If it has a lot of green arrows, I pick it. If it doesn't, uh, hey, I'm out of there, G. I am the F out. But that's, that's pretty much how it goes. If you're like that, then you, you, you'll you appreciate Dota Plus. But other than that, Dota Plus, it holds your hand literally, I feel like, too much. So, oh, there's an avoid player list. Hell, bro, I've avoided so much players. Like, this is more than... God, apparently this list was increased to 25, so now you can avoid more players. That's good. Who you calling a pinhead? <laughs> Who you calling a pinhead? Oh shit, no, you're supposed to use the new set, I forgot. I don't know, you, try, you gotta drip with the new set. I don't like the new set, man. Oh, holy shit. No, 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 no. I just stumbled across something really great, guys. Skyrim Axe. <laughs> Yo, look at this. The Dragon Ball. Like, God. How did I never see that? That's the sexiest hat I've ever seen in my entire life. I have the best axe set. No one can challenge me. Feeling good, man. Oh, is there anything that changed with individual heroes? Not same stats. Progression. No, my win rate's still shit with Void. Even though every game I demolish, still lose though. Man, this set looks so sexy. Did I turn my graphics up or something? Yo, y'all seeing this? But alright, that's the video guys, um, I might post this maybe in a month or two after I record it, you never know how I be. But um, thank you guys for watching, whoever watches, and have a nice day. Dota Plus sucks, don't buy it. It takes away our individuality and makes us all conformed players to the current meta. I do be hitting that high note though.